Hello YouTube friends and welcome. Today I have for you a new knife from a new company or should I say uh, first time featured here on my channel. So I will be talking about the Mesdrop Fair and Forge collaboration buck and a little bit about the, the history. So uh, Mesdrop Nowadays, uh, they have rebranded to just drop. It's a company who offers uh, special pricing on, uh, let's say, uh, different items. What you would uh, most likely buy online. So knives, gear, all different kinds of, uh, let's say, clothing and, and tools. Uh, they give you a uh, good product at a uh, good price mm, that can uh, change uh, like uh, some controversies about uh, the, the pricing hikes on, on some products I will briefly mention uh, this with uh, this knife but Generally, uh, if you go to, to the drop site, then you can uh, vote uh, for from products and if those products are uh, voted up and they consider to, to make uh, a drop available, then they will contact the manufacturer and ask for a uh, special pricing. So uh, it's more likely a, like with a, a volume buy functional at some uh, retailers if you buy more then you will get a better price of course but um, it is more oriented for the for the end user so you are getting your one knife or two knives but you are getting the bulk uh, pricing so basically that is the um, that is the uh, idea about the about the drop um, business model so like I mentioned, uh, now they, uh, they are rebranded just to drop and all the knives that are currently available there, you can go check the site. I will try to uh, link down uh, into, the, into the description down below where you can find the, the page. Uh, I don't know if the knife will be available uh, at the time when I post this, uh, uh, this video. Uh, so go uh, check it out if not uh, you can certainly go uh, and search on ebay because ebay has a lot of uh, lots of offers on uh, mass drop uh, products there some people just buying uh, into the drop and then trying to resell it or if they don't like it they put it on ebay so sometimes you could get a better deal even on ebay but not to ramble on too long let's see what is in the box so you can see the uh, the picture this is the knife it has a nice medication style box inside you will get a nice pouch with the master logo and the ferron forge who are the designers and uh, the designers of the knife the knife is then executed and made by v knives we all know V Knives is a Chinese company who is making awesome blades at different price points, very high quality. So inside the box you have a cloth, a silica gel packet. This is a nice two pouch carrying case. So your knife is nicely protected inside okay so I will open it for you and put it there because I need to talk about the about the, the knife itself not to fumble around so I buy the uh, the knife when the drop uh, came on it is it is always good to to have a subscription the mailer uh, they will they will send you information when new drop or new product is available, so you can go and uh, 
let's say uh, pre-order or reserve your uh, piece and I bought it back in uh, uh, in September 2018 uh, it took a little bit of the time to to get it to me and uh, back then the knife uh, was at a certain price point so the the bad thing uh, they did they uh, I'm not remembering uh, how much uh, was the was the actual price of the base model because like you can see here um, this is a let's say a uh, second uh, second tier they offer two tiers so one was just uh, your uh, standard uh, flat uh, titanium scales and the second tier option was uh, with the uh, engraving so you you got two engravings uh, this is the the mothership design and after all the add-ons i did pay uh 139.99 dollars so uh, shipping inside the us uh, is uh, for free so i had not to ship uh, uh, I had not to pay for, for shipping. Uh, if you are outside the US, you need to consider if uh, it is available to send the knife uh, to your country. They have it in their disclaimer. Yes, but uh, after I saw the, the current pricing, uh, it looks like uh, the knife uh, got a little bit up in price. So the, the base price uh, for your flat uh, titanium scale is uh, $140, so only one cent uh, more expensive than, than I bought it. But uh, if you want to have any of the engravings done, so the options, you will pay extra $25. So I don't know if the if the V of V company is charging them more or they just want to make more money because the, the drop, the product, was uh, really well received and people wanted to buy it so yes and another important uh, important thing is to know that uh, initially uh, they will have a period of time a few days or say or maybe week maybe month when they're taking orders then they will close the drop and they will then um, uh, forward the complete amount of of knives they have uh, sold uh, to the company uh, and they will uh, then produce the knife and then uh, it's a shipping out uh, period sometimes on some drops they uh, will have uh, initial stock so then you can you can buy the knife uh, whatever model uh, you would like and they will ship it to you right away so uh, when I ordered my knife I know it, it was uh, maybe maybe one week or Two, two weeks tops I should should be less but I can not remember it was last year so sorry about that but um, sometimes you need to wait but they will uh, state it in the in the description okay so for some reasons they are charging you now uh, $25 more for the uh, for the knife I don't know why maybe maybe some some uh, pricing of the workmanship uh, gone up but i highly doubt it because uh, let's face it uh, all these knives are made in china so uh, i don't know so uh, just keep that in mind so if you because i'm just mentioning because a lot of people are commenting on the on the drop uh, website uh, this comment in the description for on the knife so you can you can read it if you like uh, but whether, whether you want to uh, pay the 140 base pricing or uh, 165 for the gra engraving it is up to you if you don't want to pay it then go and look around on eBay and on some uh, maybe other sites or uh, knife forums okay so like i mentioned the knife was designed by ferron forge it's a well-known custom uh and mid-tech uh, company knife company from us uh, two brothers 
and then uh, the build was outsourced to VNICE. Uh, the blade steel, you have a S35VN blade steel. The handle is made out of 6AL4V titanium and my option was uh, with a bronzed uh, stone washed uh, finish. I hope you can see it. The blue uh, pocket clip is standard and also the ridged uh, backspacer. On the blade you have the mass drop, the model number MZ115, the blade uh, type and the Ferrum Forge design logo here. So the Ferrum Forge uh, Master Buck uh, has a modified sheep's foot uh, blade. They do offer uh, the same handle with uh, different uh, different uh, so blade options. So blade configurations uh, and they are uh, in different uh, different categories or different uh, different name is applied to the model because the, the handle is nice and you can fit uh, different sorts of uh, configurations inside okay as you can see it has a nice the blade has a nice satin finish Has a nice detent. Ceramic detent with a hardened steel insert. It rides on hardened steel um, caged bearings. The specifications are so we have a overall length of 7.8 inches or 19.8 centimeters we have a close length of 4.3 inches or 11 centimeters the blade length is 3.5 inches or 8.9 centimeters the handle thickness is 0 0.47 inches or 1.2 centimeters the blade thickness is 0 0.16 inches or 4 millimeters. Has a nice functional jimping on the top. A functional finger choil, so you can you not know, have been worried. You can choke up the blade and make some precision cuts. The weight of the knife is uh, 3.6 ounces or 103.2 grams so the fit and finish is let's say absolutely spot on no problems A smooth action nicely centered I hope you can see it perfectly centered Let's see the, the pocket clip. So this is how much it will stick out. You could almost put it in your coin pocket. And yes, you, you can choose from just your standard uh, gray finish. 
or you can also choose this nice bronze and there are a few other options uh, at the at the site if you like you can go and check it out applications wise so i would say this is a uh, really nice uh, edc functional edc blade so you can you can uh, prepare some uh, some food with it also if you if you need to to work it should be fine cutting every every materials you you need for your day-to-day -day, uh, chores So let's see some uh, comparisons. So firstly, I have here the Benchmade uh, 490 Osborne. Let's see. They're almost the same size. So a very popular EDC. And then I have here the Kershaw Skyline. Little bit, a uh, little bit larger in the back. Back Vintage Pro in S thirty V. Almost the same specifications, same size. Benchmade large reptilian, Benchmade small reptilian, Spider Cotelica four, so Endura four, and here's Delica four. Just to have some size uh, comparisons, and here is also a Strider SNG. So a lot. This is a larger knife than the Buck. Okay, so if you like the knife, go check out the Drop a website. There are nice deals over there. The action on these uh, V-made knives are spot on, so they are perfectly balanced. Yeah, really nicely made knives. Okay, so if you have any questions, leave comments down below. And as always, have a nice day. Thanks for watching.